All right. Hey, everyone. Uh, we are in the town of Newberry. It's uh, like 15 minutes outside of Gainesville where I live. Uh, Newberry is just, you know, one of those little, small little communities. It's not that small, though. I mean, really. They don't have much here, but it's pretty neat. Anyways, I'm just taking the drive over to the coast, so this video will probably be severely edited so that I can show you all when I get to the coast. I was just going to show you the beginning of the ride, though. Or sort of the beginning of the ride. I've already went through a rainstorm, and uh, so about 7.30, I have an hour to get over to the coast till sunset. Hoping I make it before the sun sets. Because uh, it's pretty awesome over there. I've never actually been to where I'm going there right now. I'm going over this one place called Shired Island. I think that's how you pronounce it. It's called S-H-I-R-E-D. Shired Island. And uh, so yeah, <laughs> don't exactly know how to get there. I just know you go towards the sun. So the sun normally doesn't move, so I think we'll be okay. It's actually amazing out right now. 60 mile per hour speed limit. Woo! -hoo! And hopefully y'all will be able to see, uh, cause like we're going sort of into the sun, it's right over there. Well, now you can't see it. There it is, hello! But yeah. I don't know why I wanted to go, I just wanted to go for one of the rides, you know. The sun sets at 8.26 tonight, and it is 7.27. And I am 61 miles away, I think, from right here. So we're going to be cutting it pretty darn close. That is if I go the speed limit. Or rather, if the speed limit is over 60 miles per hour. So yeah, this is uh, more of North Central Florida. We're going over to the Gulf side. Well, duh, because that's where the sun sets. But um, this is not the uh, coast like you're thinking of, like when you think of Florida. You know, you think of white sandy beaches. This coastline is uh, it's more like swamps and marshes and stuff. Which is neat, I mean, it's more like for fishing and stuff. not the touristy part. The touristy part doesn't start until you basically get south of, uh, south of Inglis, which is, uh, like, closer to Tampa. Look at this, though. The fields. It's beautiful out here right now. I've got to watch my time, because I want to be able to show you all, uh, some of that without having to edit out that much. Over there, you can see, look at that, there's some big clouds and stuff. So uh, on my way back, I'll probably hit a lot of rain, which is okay, I brought my rain pants today. And I am all suited up, as you can see. I'm sorry if um, it annoys some of you that you can't actually see like my, my instruments while I'm driving. It's just how I sit. I sit in a really upright position when I'm riding. And I find it really comfortable that way. The wind doesn't bother me at all. So like, I mean, I could drop down like this. But, I don't know, I don't like that. I do when it's crazy windy out, but right now it's not. Oh look, cows, 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 or no, goats. There's a couple of cows, lots of cows. Cows are starting to become a theme in my videos. I think I've shown them like, that's like the fourth time I've shown cows in my videos. Florida isn't really known for cows, but apparently they have a lot of them. I forget if ours are the milk producing ones or the beef ones. The milk ones get it good, or get the better end of the deal because, well, they don't get killed. <laughs> Uh, here's a not so pretty field. 
Looks like they've burned it. They're going to plant something else there that used to not be there. All right, here's gas. I haven't bought gas in a couple of days because I haven't went anywhere. Let's see how much it is. Ooh, $2.55. We're going up. And speed limit back up to 60 or stayed 60. I don't know if it ever went down or not. I wasn't paying attention. I guess when I go home, I can see all the logs that I break. I don't think I, I don't intentionally try to break any. I mean, I try to follow every speed limit and all that. Because who wants a ticket when they're 18? I know I don't. There's some more fields. That place sells lawn ornaments. Like a Christmas tree. Alright. We are going up and over the hill. Alright, look at that. This road is like as straight as an arrow. I mean, I can see probably, that's probably 10 miles to the end of the road. That's one thing I don't like. Because, like, Florida, even though, like, right here, it's not really all that flat, it's flat enough that they just make the roads as straight as possible. It's like some of the interstates through the desert and stuff out in Texas and Arizona and New Mexico. Straight as an arrow. But, I mean, these aren't even the interstates. These are the back roads, so there's no other way to make it interesting. So anyways, um, I think I am going to pull off up here. Let's see, there's no cars behind me. So you know what? I am just going to pull off on the side of the road right here. Let's hope no cars come up behind. Alright, and... Going to stop the video here, so uh, I'll see you guys in a minute. Hey everyone, uh, it's Ninja Noel. Um, I told you I was going to show you me riding out here, but the sun is just now setting, if we can zoom in a little bit. And uh, I might actually post this as a video response to it. Uh, um, oh, I forget right now, I'm sorry, but uh, he posted a sunset. But yeah, so here we are, we're out on uh, Shired Island. It's pretty much all marshland. It's there's waters and everything. And then, here we are. And there's some big clouds over there, as usual. But anyways, yep. And more road. Um, I'll probably make another video of me driving. I'm going to continue on this way until it gets sort of dark. But anyway, so yep. Um, so uh, here it is. Talk to you guys later.